There we go. Now we're recording. We can include Dwarvish's adventures in South African desert in red. Perfect. Yeah. It was hot. The highest temperature we got there was like 41 degrees. Meanwhile, I've been thinking it's been unseasonably hot, being between 10 and 15. I mean, it has been unseasonably hot, because it's supposed to be, like, between 5 and 10. Yeah. <laughs> but no. It's going to be hot, because screw you. Yeah. Um, I don't actually have a lot of stuff to rant about today, Nico. Well, then. well, don't have a lot of stuff to rant about yesterday, Nico. <laughs> yeah, uh, well, you know. Because I entirely forgot that yesterday was Sunday. Yeah. Z T three A two got new missile sound. Yeah. Funny. some other stuff that got new sounds as well but I can't remember what it was but yeah I um, once again managed to be an entire day behind in my own head which is kind of impressive to be yeah. honest <laughs> like I would have understood it with me considering I sometimes just uh, die for an entire day So, yeah, that, you know, that that, that that actually just makes it worse that you know I'm up every day and I still manage to. Yeah, that that's kind of my point though. Uh, like, if it was me that forgot which day, well, that would make sense, but not yeah. you. Got that? <laughs> yeah. That happens Anywho. to me as well. In you, I got new uh, player's handbook for D and D five point five. I have really interesting hopes for Roger Beard in management, Berserker. <laughs> it's uh, gonna be an adventure and a half, but yes, new handbook. Yeah. With the alternate art. It wasn't supposed to ship until Saturday, the 5th. Uh, I, I, I went and picked it up on Friday, the 4th. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. And I, I've basically been reading through it on my free time. I've gotten to... Where have I actually gotten to? That's... Page I, 152 billion. No, that's what it feels it's like. Not that many something pages. Yeah, sorry, it's only 15 billion. With 152. Only on page 233. Oh, uh, God. <laughs> Let's not include the index pages in the actual contents. That's that feels a bit cheaty. Out of three hundred and seventy-seven, so only like two thirds of the way through. Now, oh, you know when new players want to try D and D. Yeah, I understand why they get overwhelmed. Yeah, um, and and honestly, having been reading through this. Um, they haven't made it better. <laughs> it doesn't well, surprise me. They, they, they have made character creation a bit more complicated. Um, they have made melee combat a bit more complicated to help boost it overall. Um, what, you have to think and not just go bonk, bonk hard and bonk harder? Well, you see, they they have changed the entire, shall we say, pipeline of creating a character. Because before yes. you would very simply just you you would get just stats like the six main stats, then you would pick your race and your class, and add whatever bonuses you got from get from those, and you would effectively have a playable character. Now, yeah. you pick your class, 
And that class has some a few backgrounds that tie into it nicely, uh, primarily because they they give bonuses to the primary skills of your class. But you get I think all the all the backgrounds have three different skills that you can increase in. Um, Are you seeing it as a historian background doesn't work well with a barbarian. I am saying that being a, a an acolyte or a scribe, um, you you don't really get any of the physical stats as options for increase for that because apparently books aren't that heavy <laughs> really <laughs> honestly i beg to differ i mean they are but you know they, they take more brain power than muscle power to work with i mean I left to the librarian or this library because uh, I've seen those guys without any cards just carry tons and tons about tons of books. Yeah. Um. I'm trying to find the nine while I got to shoot. The, they have and... made. I'm not even entirely sure I agree fully with it. They have made the species as they call it now rather than race uh a lot less influential on your the limits lady. of your character the limits of your character and a lot more inclusive so you can now make a human character with dwarfism if you like you can now be <sighs> a small human like actual small sized human It's been the becoming woke. <laughs> Little bit. Well, let's see. Who owns D and D again? Currently, uh, like it, it's not too bad. Um, there is also the artwork of the wild magic sorcerer has a magical prosthetic arm. Which I mean, it, it's it's within the universe. It was just a Lacks kind of fun detail. <laughs> exactly, <laughs> or Warforged for that matter. Um, but there was what also, about the Warforged artificer? Like I, I am. There was also an image somewhere of an adventurer in a wheelchair. Ah. Uh... I used to be an adventurer like you, but then I took an arrow to the knee. Which, it's, it's again, going. I mean, to, to some extent, I can see it working for an artificer. Do you know how you beat or, him? Or, or, or a gnome cast that you, you run upstairs. Zeka, all it would take would, would be a staff that you throw on the ground to stop him in his tracks. <laughs> I was more thinking uh, you get a quest in the top of a wizard's tower. <laughs> Crap. Have fun getting up there. Mr. Step, Mr. Step, Mr. Step, Mr. Step. <laughs> and that's why, like, artifices, which aren't an official uh, class for... Actually, no, it wasn't. That was something else. No, Artificer isn't an, an official thing for the new edition yet. Um, uh, but it is backwards compatible, at least. So you can use anything from 5e. You just don't, don't get the uh, the stat bonuses from anything but your background. So that is something, at least. Um, but yeah, you, you'd have to... Actually, you could cheese that because, you know, you could just telekinesis your wheelchair. Yep. <laughs> you could. <laughs> Instead of casting fly on you, you cast telekinesis on your wheelchair. If you have a very, very light wheelchair, could you catapult it? <laughs> I mean, technically, yes. Like, it would stop immediately when it hits you, but, you know. 
But you know, th 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 there are ways with magic to work your way around being in a wheelchair. So it it could make sense for a caster being in a wheelchair. What if you imbue a crystal with fly or something like that? Yeah. On the wheelchair. Like, but there are ways to work around it. As long as you don't choose to be a barbarian or a fighter. <laughs> I'm going to go jousting with my wheelchair. <laughs> hmm. Would it count as a mount? Technically. You're screwed when you find any stairs, but... Uh... I found it! Hey! Um... So yeah, lots of changes. And I really do like the changes they've done to melee, the melee classes, because now you get um, weapon masteries in addition to proficiencies. Which essentially just means you're so good at using a weapon that you can now make it do more than just hurt. So if you hit something with a fucking giant ass maul, for example, you knock them on their ass because you are hitting them really hard in the face with about 10 kilos of fucking stone or steel. So it, it makes sense now. Yeah. But also, holy fuck, it's going to be a nightmare of uh, conditions to keep track of. <laughs> Something tells me we should just stick to 5e for now. Uh, yeah. At least for the rest of current adventure, and until I can find a uh, bottle of rum version of five point five. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> well, they do like a lot of changes. I have, I haven't really found anything where I'm like, why yet. <clears throat> I hope, he, I, hope he, um, I hope you saw the picture without reading the text above it. World's unofficial most venomous spider, uh, six-sided sand spider, has two recorded... Oh, wait, no, I didn't type that. I booped it. Whoops. <laughs> Good job, Bosh. I was still um, it as I was typing. Anyway, I got to shoot this. We also have way more subclasses now. All, all the different classes has... Four subclasses. Instead of cleric having eight and barbarian having two. Hmm. So yeah. Oh, he said nine. Now, eh? well, one thing I will actually rant about. Uh oh. Because <laughs> um, lately, when I've been going on YouTube, where I am using um, Adblock and started using that primarily. Because uh, watching a 15 minute video, you ended up watching fucking 20 minutes of ads. Yeah, and sometimes the ads uh, shouldn't be there, especially the ones for some of the mobile games. Um, yeah, also that. The, the quality of them was horrible. Not but just that, but some of, some of them is basically straight porn, but that, that's, that's fine. <laughs> ah, yeah. But we can't say S in a YouTube video because the algorithm doesn't like that. Exactly. So it's, um... <laughs> doesn't make any sense. Nope. We want to make YouTube child-friendly. We're also going to host this ad on that oh, child oh, video. Oh, yeah. That there was actually a huge uproar about that in Denmark for that. It's a few years ago now. Where... remember what it was i think it was the nun the the horror movie oh yeah yeah, the, yeah. The, that got played as ads 
yep. in all videos on YouTube. Including... <laughs> including on channels with stuff that was literally made for kids. Like, <laughs> preschool pre age kids. Oh, and look! Cartoon! Horror movie starts. <laughs> uh, 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 I think this is the wrong cartoon. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. It's uh, it's quite impressive now, isn't it? Yeah. Like, I understand that a company at the size of Google could easily mess up at some point in the chain. Yeah. But, but not like that. But that is <laughs> bad. But yeah, um, I've now started getting the fucking embedded ads, which are essentially the same fucking piece of shit ads you get in mobile games and like crap like that. Yeah. In my YouTube, well, not in, but before my. The, the videos on YouTube. Yep. Because Google is such a fucking money-greedy nugget of a company that instead of just saying, you know what, all right, we're going to do like maybe a, a minute, two minutes of ads at the start or at the end of a YouTube video, if it's more than say 10 or 15 minutes long fair enough yeah. like if 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 less than 10 percent of total runtime is ad fair enough don't mind watching that i mean i'm not gonna pay fucking any attention to it but like don't mind doing that uh, yeah no, no that's fair enough like but when we start having fucking more ads than actual video yeah, that's not... No. Just no. Yeah. That is why Adblock. That is why so many people use Adblock. Now, on the note of uh, Google being greedy, um, that is largely due to its shareholders, to be fair. I mean, yeah. Uh, because they have to be satisfied or they're going to pull out their funds, and that's going to be um, yeah. you know, such a problem for a basically internet monopoly at this point yeah a lot of evils in this world can be traced back to <laughs> to investors on the open market now can it yeah especially uh, let's see war is a uh, big thing yeah because you know general <laughs> general electric we haven't made enough money this quarter selling washing machines. Let's um, let, let, let's be pro-war so we can sell some more Gatling guns. Yeah, it's um, quite good and um, funny, isn't it? Some of it. Yeah, it's not great. There's so many comp like there's so many companies out there that you don't think about that makes things like weapons and stuff, but they do. Yeah. Uh, one of my favorite one is Saab. Yep. Because what else does Saab makes? Yeah, um, fighters. I mean, in they fairness, in they fairness, they can't do stars. <laughs> in fairness, um, like, but while Saab for most people mean car. Or a truck, because... Or trucks, yeah. Um, they very much started building planes, and then later went on to build all the other Yeah, I stuff. know. I'm, I'm aware. But then take Ford, for instance. They very much started building war planes. Well, take Ford, then. Yeah. They aren't exactly... Um unguilty of making a, you know lending their manufacturing power to other things and not thinking just world war ii here we have sub in game yeah darken vegan and actual actual yep. sub 
Yeah, I know we have a few things that are called Saab, but um, I'm not sure the J22 was. But the J21, that's built by Saab. The J29s, those are built by Saab. The J32s, those are built by Saab. The Dragons, the Vikings, the Gribbons, those are built by Saab. The SK60 and the derivatives of that, that's built by Saab. It's, just, uh, it's funny, isn't it? Like basically, half the Swedish air tree is Saab. And, uh, like, if you take the company Leica, you know, they made camera lenses and stuff, and uh, sniper optics for the Germans. Yep. Because camera lens is essentially a uh, fucking optic. I mean, it, I, well, it is. <laughs> yeah. Direct light into a single point. Uh, yep. On optic, that's your eye. <laughs> yep. And magnif Ooh, magnifies no. and stuff, depending on the lens as well. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. The funny thing is, photo lenses has to even be more precise than sniper lenses. Yeah. Or sight or lenses, I guess. Or, um, yeah, you know what I mean. I love the fact that Saab made the Carl Gustav and the Enlaw. Yeah. The Swedes. The shit at most things. But the weapons it, they can do, apparently. <laughs> including just being people. But weapons and cars. They are really fucking good at. Uh, there's one more thing they're also really fucking good at for whatever reason. Uh, bowling. Bowling. Well, yeah, you know, I, I don't know why. They should just make body armor out of Nokia phones. Uh, they Literally... tried that with, uh, <laughs> they, they got, they, well, one guy stole it and, well, they haven't been able to catch him yet. Mm. Some of those nuclear tests out in the desert was actually trying to kill that guy, but no, Nokia just survived. Um, you know, what are we doing? If you get close enough with that, it's only going to be the best left. Nah. <laughs> oh, best yeah, of my side. Fair enough, I guess. Oh, do we have anything else to rant about? Mm. Uh, yeah, don't train too hard or you might puke like I did today. Bad idea. Or end up with bleeding hands. Ah, that's bowling. Well, you know, that that can also be applied as training. You know. Yeah, but it wasn't a match though, so... Yeah, that, but... That's eh. win, damn it. <laughs> Don't do what I did in poker, Scorpion, you don't recognize. Or severely, <laughs> or very, very venomous spiders. What idea of that was? <laughs> that, that, that makes it worse. Life advice with Scorpion. <laughs> do not touch things that are potentially <laughs> able to kill you. <laughs> Especially if you don't know what it is. <laughs> How have you survived this long again? Because <laughs> he hasn't gone and played with Stingray shit. Um, let me just find the photo quickly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know you have, but <laughs> that wasn't the joke. <laughs> I know it's a joke, but it's not funny. <laughs> Uh yeah. I'm scared for the future of humanity. <laughs> Emerson, give this man a camera crew. <laughs> Send him off places where there's funny animals. Yes. He will go full alligator um, <laughs> guy on, on it. I will go full Floridian on every animal I see. 
Yoink. This is yes. Oh, look, guys, I found a Brazilian wandering spider. Oops. Oh, oh, he's coming home with me. Seriously, I'm, I'm, at some point I'm going to see in some newspaper a uh, guy pokes Tiger with a stick and he got angry. <laughs> the Tiger lost. Tiger lost yeah. the fight. <laughs> tigers are weird. Like, ti tigers are scary until you think about the fact that they have dots on the backs of their ears to deter predators. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are they the apex predator? Well, yeah. <laughs> so why the fuck have they evolved that? I'm not just scared about what they see as their predator. That's really... Um... Yeah, exactly. I'm scared that we haven't found it yet. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> haven't flodged. <laughs> It, it is the predator. Ah, yes. Ah, the scale of predators. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Anyway, th there is a uh, War Thunder pain to do, so let's end ramp and start grinding. Yep. I'll be there as soon as I'm done with this run.